Hi guys, finally back in the workshop. I've decided that um, seeing as I haven't had a lot of motivation recently that I give myself a little bit of fun uh, rather than focusing on all of the other things that I have to do. Procrastinating like a true teenager um, that I am not, unfortunately, anymore. But anyway, so in light of my, you know, lack of teenagerhood, I've decided to go back to my gaming days and one of my favourite games to play, which I still play, is Skyrim. And uh, obviously Anyone who's on the internet knows about Skyrim, and if you don't, I feel sorry for you, find out about it, because it's really, really fun. Now in Skyrim, obviously, pretty much every character build I've ever done, I've focused on blacksmithing. I wonder why that would be. Anyway, in order to level up your Skyrim, your Skyrim blacksmithing really fast, most people will know to use one piece of iron and one leather strip, and to create an iron dagger. So, in light of that, I've decided to give myself a Skyrim blacksmithing challenge. So, to, in order to do that challenge, I'm going to use one leather strip and one pound of iron, so this is one pound of 5160 steel, to create a dagger. Now, I'm not going to try and create, recreate the exact Skyrim um, dagger, but I am going to create something dagger-like that is going to involve these two items to create the full thing. On top of that, I'm only going to be using hand-powered tools, so files, chisels, that kind of thing, in order to create this. I've given myself two days to create this, and hopefully I'll be able to get it finished before Wednesday, so this will be uploaded then. If not, this will be uploaded on Saturday. So, if this is uploaded on Saturday, it took me more than two days. Anyway, hopefully you enjoy this little challenge, and anyone out there who's a blacksmith as well, which I know some of you are, please feel free to take up, take up this challenge and post a video response. I know that that's not a thing that we can do, but if you tag it to me on Facebook, Instagram, or here on YouTube, then I'd be more than happy to watch it, and I love to see people getting inspiration from my, my YouTube videos. Anyway, stick, it, stick with it, and enjoy.
Hey guys, hope you enjoyed the video. I sure enjoyed making it. It was great fun and a great challenge for myself. And uh, here it is, the Skyrim Dagger. Now I did take some inspiration from the Skyrim Iron Dagger, but I didn't mean to recreate it exactly. Um, I just basically wanted to make a dagger with only hand tools, and I think I successfully made a pretty decent dagger. I'm very happy with how it came out. It actually has a really good balance point right on the guard. Um, the handle is nice and comfortable because I use the wax finish. It's got a very warm in the hand feel, kind of like natural wood. Um, and yeah, it, it just came out really good for, um, for a sh such a short period of time. Unfortunately, I only uh, it took me three days rather than two uh, to do it. I had 12 hours in total of work on it, um, spread over three days because I've got a lot of other stuff going on in the background, as most of you will know. Um, but yeah, it was an awesome challenge. And to further up my intro to this video, I want to create the hashtag Skyrim challenge. Basically, this has encouraged me to keep bladesmithing, keep making awesome stuff. And I want to send that out to you guys, all of my fellow knife makers. Whether or not you're an, a uh, stock removal knife maker or a bladesmith like myself, I want to encourage you to do something that you're not, you know, outside of your comfortable comfort zone. And basically, that challenge is a pound of steel, some leather, and hand tools. Get out there and make yourself a knife. Now, I'm not saying you have to make a dagger or, you know, anything from Skyrim. Just a knife. So, uh, a hunting knife, a camp knife, a buoy knife, you name it. But the only rules of the challenge are leather, pound of steel, and hand tools. That's all. And um, yeah, I'd really love to see what you guys come up with. So I'll be searching the hashtag Skyrim Challenge on Instagram and Facebook and here on YouTube as well. And I'm really looking forward to seeing if anyone comes out with anything. You can also email your hashtag Skyrim Challenge photos to me at my email, which is linked in my Facebook page. Um, but yeah, I really want to get you guys out there and making something. This is, you know, super important to me to inspire people to make stuff because I love making stuff. So anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it and you haven't subscribed already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. I am putting out new videos every Wednesday and uh, obviously sometimes on Saturdays. And uh, if you do hit the subscribe button, make sure you hit the notification icon to get notified of when I upload a new video, because unfortunately YouTube doesn't always do that unless you hit that icon. Also, if you can hit the like button, it always helps. It helps me get the videos out there. And if you have any comments, suggestions, or questions, please leave them in the comment section down below, and I will respond to them. I respond to every comment left on my videos, as some people know. Anyway, guys, I'll see you in the next video.